it's Demi and the holidays are back here at Disney's Hollywood Studios and you know what that means? The holiday snacks are back. Hollywood Studios always has some incredible holiday treats and I'm going to show you them all today. Make sure to check out my guide to Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party and my guide to the brand new Jollywood Nights which is the new after party here at Disney's Hollywood Studios. I will link those videos for you here and put it in the description box below. But now let's get into it. Let's see those holiday treats at Hollywood Studios and let's go get into some hygiene. We are starting these holiday treats off at the Trolley Car Cafe for two holiday snacks. Before you get to the counter, one of the two treats we're getting you're gonna pick up here and it is the Whoopie Pie. Here is our holiday haul from Trolley Car Cafe. First we have the Red Velvet Whoopie Pie with candy cane cream and sprinkles. And then we have a classic gingerbread cookie shaped like a Mickey. Here is the inside of the cookie. Let's give it a try. It's a very cute treat, but it's very chewy and very dry. Um, it's not my favorite. It has a nice ginger flavor, I will say, but it is incredibly dry. Definitely get some coffee when you get this, if you get this. But for me, I don't think I would return to the gingerbread cookie. Here is the inside of the whoopie pie. The cream looks really interesting. I'm curious to see how this peppermint cream will taste. I am a huge fan of peppermint. I love lots of peppermint flavors during this time of year. Um, it's not like bad at all. It's not spectacular. And it, to me, a little bit had a bit of a toothpaste vibe after I swallowed because it's that creaminess. I mean, it's very artificial, the cream, but it's, it's hard to say. I don't want to say 100% tastes like peppermint or 100% tastes like toothpaste. It's kind of in the middle. So make of that as you will and maybe see for yourself. If you get this snack, let me know what you think of it. Heading into Toy Story Land for our next snack and look, Woody is all dressed up for the holidays. We are heading into Woody's Lunchbox to pick up our seasonal lunchbox tart. Lunchbox tarts are basically like better versions of pop tarts that this quick service restaurant makes. Here is the holiday lunchbox tart. It is a hot chocolate lunchbox tart, chocolate fudge filling, hot chocolate marshmallow fondant, and mini marshmallows. Let's give it a try. There is that inside. Let's give it a try. And real quick, I mean, how adorable. It is very, very fudgy. That has a lot of chocolate. Wow. I want to try one more time with the marshmallow. Mmm. The marshmallow definitely adds to it, but it is a very chocolatey, very chocolatey treat. I love the pastry though on the lunchbox tarts. This one in particular is slightly drier than what I'm used to with these, but still so much flavor, super flaky. If you like chocolate, you're gonna like this, but it is just chocolate on chocolate on chocolate. And before we go, Alien Swirling Saucer got a little holiday overlay. They're playing some holiday music. Let's head into ABC Commissary for our next two snacks. Here we have the holiday mini bundt cake. Spice cake rolled in cinnamon sugar with apple pie filling and topped with spice, maple buttercream, and salted caramel icing. It looks amazing. Let's try this bundt cake. Here is the inside. Look at all that apple filling. Let's give it a try. Got a little bit of everything. Oh, this is a big bite. Oh no. It has a lot of spice on the cake, that cinnamon spice. It's kind of a little too much for me. And the apples just taste very artificial and just like very, very like sharply sweet artificial taste. It's not very good in my opinion. It's not terrible, but it just tastes, the whole thing just tastes very artificial. I think it's beautiful. I think it's so gorgeous how it shimmers. The cake itself is like fine. Like I said, I think it's a little over spiced, but I think just overall, you get that artificial taste out of it. So I personally would not return to it, but if you get this snack, please let me know what you think of it. The last treat you can get from ABC Commissary is the frozen 
caramel hot chocolate topped with mini marshmallows and sauce. I got it last year. It's super delicious and refreshing. You can also get it at Backlot Express, Pizza Rizzo, and Rosie's All-American Cafe. It's very chocolatey and nice and cool. Over on Sunset Boulevard, we are hitting up the Sunset Market Ranch and we are going to Rosie's All-American Cafe for our next treat. Santa Mickey Cupcake. It's chocolate cake filled with mocha fudge and topped with red almond buttercream, white chocolate, and dark chocolate Mickey Mouse ears. Let's open it up and see the inside. Here is the inside, that chocolate. It's been a very chocolatey day. Let's do it. Got a little bit of everything. Okay, the fudge flavor is, it's so there, right? It's so incredibly fudgy for me personally. I think it's just a lot of fudge, but I know a lot of people like this, so this may be for you. And the flavors are very good, but it is mostly that fudgy flavor. That buttercream is very smooth and nice, but it is a just a fudgy, fudgy, fudgy cupcake. So if that's for you, then you may love this. Personally, I would not return to it. It's just a lot of fudge. At the end of Sunset Boulevard is Hollywood Scoops ice cream. Once again, you can get that candy cane milkshake, peppermint ice cream shake topped with whipped cream, chocolate cake donut, and candy cane sprinkles. I had it last year. I found it to be just incredibly too sweet for me personally. The peppermint flavor was definitely a lot better than I would say of the whoopie pie that I had this morning. I liked that flavor a little more, but it's just a lot, a lot of sweetness in the ice cream. I really did like the donut though, and if you like a peppermint shake, this is definitely something to consider getting. Over at the snack stands and also at the Dockside Diner, you will find the Mickey Brownie, but they zhuzhed it up for the holidays. It's the same Mickey Brownie that's always there, but they gave it a little holiday flair. Entering my favorite land in Hollywood Studios, and look at these pretty trees they have this year, and we are heading into Pizza Rizzo. Make sure to place your mobile order for Pizza Rizzo and don't forget to say hi to Santa on your way in. Here is our final snack on this holiday stroll through Hollywood Studios, the melted snowman sugar cookie. It's a sugar cookie with red and green sugar, white chocolate, marshmallow, dark chocolate top hat, raspberry, chocolate twigs, orange sprinkle, and chocolate covered cocoa nibs. Let's open them up and see the inside. Here is the inside. Let's give them a try. Last snack. Uh, ah! <laughs> I'm amazing. Did you see that? This though, not amazing. All of that together was way too much. It was just like pure sugar, especially with that marshmallow. The cookie itself is very tasty. It's just, you know, it's a sugar cookie, but it's, it's good. However, the white chocolate on top I'm just personally not a fan. It, it was just too crystallized, too heavy, and just very artificial, not good chocolate tasting on there. It just didn't go well together, in my opinion. Um, it's such a cute treat, though, and the cookie itself is good. So if you are into that, this may be for you, but unfortunately, I don't think I would return to it. I mean, but it was super adorable. Well, my dudes, those were the holiday treats here at Disney's Hollywood Studios. Let me know in the comments which snack do you want to try the most, which snack do you not want to try at all, and which snack are you most curious about. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you did like the video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification so you don't miss anything that goes on this channel. Follow me on Instagram at Magical Hijinx. Check out the Patreon, become a patron, and get exclusive bonus content, bonus lives, a free dining guide to Walt Disney World by Disney for Foodies, help with trip planning, and so much more. And you'll be helping me to continue bringing you great content like these snack videos to this channel. And until next time, my dudes, I hope you guys get to some hijinks very, very soon. Happy holidays. Bye-bye.